Guys, so in today's video, we are going to see some internship opportunities from the very famous Qualcomm and we are going to see some internship from Intel. All of these are entry level internships. So you will get to know that what are the current requirements of the companies. If you are a fresher, there is uh, what chances are there to join these companies in what fields you can try those things we are going to see. Uh, if you are interested in working with core companies, this is definitely a good place uh, for you because we post videos on job opportunities from core companies on electronics. If you are interested in electronics sector, this is the right place for you. So please consider subscribing and support the channel by sharing the videos with your friends. Let's move on to the video content. Okay, so I was uh, very curious to know like what is the current requirement of uh, Intel? What is the current requirement of Qualcomm, what are the internship opportunities with these companies? So I was going through their career site and from the official company site, I try to pick up some opportunities for you. And I'm going to share that with you uh, in just a few minutes. So uh, if you are following the channel, uh, I have posted videos on embedded system skills needed to get placed. What are the skills needed in VLSI field uh, to get placed? Those things you can also explore those videos. But this video is full about internships. The first one is one year internship software CDC, Chennai, Tamil Nadu. This is an internship from the Qualcomm. I am currently in the career site of Qualcomm. And to be honest, if you want to get into Qualcomm, uh, you have to go through uh, mostly placement institutes. You have to get certified you have to get good certifications or some trainings only then there is uh you know only then it will be easy for you to get placed in these companies because it's it's very difficult otherwise to get placed and uh that's the truth but this one this is a very recent opportunity and it is in the software development and the location is Chennai, tamil nadu so let's see what are the requirements okay this is a one year internship so you have to be available for one year if your college is allowing you to get a uh, you know internship in qualcomm for one year you can definitely do this the job area is engineering software it's a software development job chennai is the location eligibility is 2025 20, master of graduates who are available for one year of internship as a software engineer you will develop design uh, software for qualcomm mobile chipsets mobile chipsets which are based on cutting edge technology qualcomm is looking for energetic creative and self-driven engineer to work in multimedia technologies such as audio video codec image processing wireless modem technology such as 4g um wi-fi bluetooth self-organizing networks etc platform level software such as linux android windows broadband packages iot technologies for uh, connected cameras smart assistants drones virtual reality augmented reality so you can now screenshot take a screenshot of this screen you can save it somewhere you can know that okay these are the current requirements campus graduates will be working on the following area so these are the areas in which you are going to work if you are getting hired here okay develop real-time embedded software which is very very highly trending now device drivers mobile software development for windows mobile android linux good uh, understanding of os concepts data structure cc plus plus object oriented design wireless network standards like cdma gsm umts lte linux unix linux drivers linux kernel development protocols like as ttp udp ip sip rtp multimedia technologies like audio video imaging excellent analytic yeah audio video imaging full stop excellent analytical skills problem solving skills ability to collaborate work in teams these are soft skills okay software development of android um and then device uh, driver development wireless modem connectivity software firmware development communication protocol software development kernel bsp device driver uh, development application software ui development software architecture for embedded device is based on android windows design and development based on object oriented programming okay so these are the skills you can definitely take a screenshot of this page uh, right here and you can definitely use it for your preparation 
this is the things that you have learned in your BTEC or in your MTEC. Requirement is Masters in Computer Science Engineering, Communication Engineering or ECE. Fair enough, right? Okay, not need of any experience, no need for that. You need to have a master degree. If you are having that, you're definitely eligible to, um, eligible to apply. Let's move to the internships offered by Intel. So I found these two internships. AI Research Engineer Scientist, AI Research Scientist. Let's see them. AI Research Scientist. Uh, yeah, Bangalore, Karnataka, India, Software Engineering. Work mode is hybrid, means you can work from home and work from uh, company, part time. Yes, anyway, the location is Bangalore. Qualification you must possess minimum qualification to be initially considered for the position. Preferred qualification is additional requirement. Okay, requirement is this mass uh, minimum qualification PhD or master's research in electrical or computer engineering or computer science or relevant engineering discipline. You need to have minimum one year of experience in machine learning, artificial intelligence res related research, one to three year of experience in GPU, Xeon uh, programming, performance profiling and characterization and architecture specification optimization, one to three year of experience in hardware software core design, uh, system architecture, performance optimization, one to three year of experience in compiler techniques. Those are the requirements. Yeah. So you need to. That is basically you need to have like one year of experience. If you are having minimum one year of experience in AI development, AI uh, design, uh, that is the requirement. So this is purely an artificial intelligence based job. As I have said in multiple videos before, AI has a lot of demand. If you're a, if you're a fresher, if you're looking for opportunities in AI, there is a lot of internships available. So I can post them if you are, if you are in requirement because I asked before, but nobody responded. So I thought like, okay, you guys may be not interested in AI. AI has a lot of demand. AI is the next trending field. So they have a lot of, uh, or the current trending field, not the next. This is also a similar one. This is also a research scientist, engineer, uh, Bangalore, Karnataka. Requirement is one to two year of experience. It's not the previous one. It's different. Okay. PhD freshers or one to three, uh, two year of experience, uh, master degree or four plus year of inch four plus year of graduation in the field of uh, computer science electrical electronics ai ml rele uh, relevant field experience and development of ai models excellent communication skill proficiency in python i i got a comment uh, do a video for embedded automotive python development it's very specific i can i cannot teach you that much advanced because I just know the basics of Python. I have done uh, projects in Python, but not too much specific. So if you want like a basic thing, basic course or basic video, how to do basic Python programming, I can do that. Familiarity with uncertainty, uncertainty estimation methods, strong analytical problem solving skill. Uh, preferred qualification is this track uh, AI ML conferences, publication, deep learning uh, software development, experience in transformer foundation models. Yeah, basically this is like purely a AI related job again, but it's not the previous one, it's a different one. But both are for Bangalore location. Here they are asking for one to two year of experience. The previous one was asking for one to four year of experience. You can find both here. So I'm gonna post this link in the description box. So all the links are available in the description. These are the internship opportunities in uh, Qualcomm and Intel. Qualcomm is looking for uh, mobile chipset development interns. Intel is mo mostly concentrated on the AI field. So that's a conclusion. So now we can decide where, what set type of certification you want to take and what type of training you want to do. Uh, yeah, that's all for today's video. Really, really hoping that you found the content useful. If yes, please uh, share the video with your friends. Consider subscribing if the videos are useful. Thanks for watching and keep on watching.